All right, hello everybody. This is Reviews and More, back with a quick review, and this one's going to be very quick because it's not positive. So this is the Seiko 2022 Melodies in Motion Clock. They put this out every single year. Um, they've changed the crystals used in it. It's no longer a Swarovski. Now it's the uh, other brand you just saw pop up. Um, the only real difference there is one's made in the Czech Republic. That's the one you're seeing in this clock, and one in uh, Swarovski crystals are made in uh, Austria. But um, in just a moment, once I get this thing unboxed, and show you all the little PC parts and all that fun stuff. Um, I'll show you a quick audio of why this is basically these clocks have been getting I guess less and less quality as time goes on and it seems more or less like a cheap fix that they just don't want to implement. So here's the color combo. It's basically a, it's a brown earth tone kind of clock this year so you see like the co the Roman columns on there and that kind of stuff. Um, one of the big changes is the back no longer uses a dial for the volume. Instead uses a, uh, up and down buttons, which is actually to me a big improvement um, just because it makes it easier to know what's actually going on back there. Uh, but as always, the batteries go in just like normal. They go in little tabs and you see me undoing them there. But uh, it takes four C batteries and they tend to last about half a year. I'd say about six months if it's on full volume. So it's going to go off. has a light sensor. Light sensor works perfectly fine. If it's dark, it doesn't go off. It's, if you got some lights on, it will go off every time. But overall, um, this is getting returned because the quality control or the parts they're using have just gotten to the point that now you can hear the grinding of the mechanism over the music, even when it's on full volume. It's going to be a little difficult to tell at the end of the video when I play, I believe, one random Christmas song on there but I'm gonna bring up in just a moment a video snippet that's just using the microphone that comes with the camera now the obviously the clock will be very close up so it can capture the audio but um, I'm in my 30s my, I've been wearing headphones my whole life I can hear it from across the room when it's going so it's, it, even if the mic doesn't pick it up while the music's playing that's partially because the microphone is going to prioritize the, lar the larger sound to the exclusion of softer noises but um, the human ear can definitely pick up the sound of the grinding gears as that uh, turning mechanism is going so one, in just a moment you're going to see me kind of messing around and hit the button you'll hear me talk on the actual audio for the camera so it'll sound a little different but that'll be about it all right, I was going to hear the gears grinding, which makes me kind of bummed out with the quality, but hit the button. Alright, so that's the issue guys, that's the noise it makes, that grinding sound, you can hear it across the room when it's on full volume, so if you have this thing playing on half volume, you can hear it very clearly. So unfortunately this is a big no-go for me, um, I'm just not happy with it, I wish it were better, but it's just, over the last few years, I don't know if they're using cheaper parts, using cheaper mechanisms for where the gears are or what, but it's just, it. to me, I, I, can, only, I can just picture there being a fix for it that costs like 25 cents and they just don't implement it to cut costs so I'm unhappy with it I'm gonna return it I would advise you not to purchase this or give it as a gift so kinda of bummed about it but I'll end the video on just the actual uh, actual song being played from a distance and if you turn the volume up you will probably be able to hear just a hint of that sound and remember the camera is basically the, the sound intake on the camera the, or the microphone is designed to hear the, the sound supposed to hear the human ear is a little more sensitive and you can hear every bit of that grinding over the music, even at full volume. So very unhappy with it. I wish they did better. And I wish I could say this is a one-off, but based on what the quality has been as time goes on, I noticed it in last year's there was kind of a grinding in it. Um, and this year, same thing's happening. I think this is just officially either a new normal or they've just given up and they or they're just putting profit over production value. So it's unfortunate, but it's the way it is. So here is the sound of the actual uh, thing playing at a distance for a full song. <laughs> 